So May 2004. This is actually a day before my birthday. This is like May 14th. You're about to turn how old? I'm about to turn 17. We're going to a party. I was with a random ass crew of like seven people. I just remember every seat in my mom's van was filled. Yeah. So there's seven of us. We go to this girl's house. And I really didn't drink at all until near the end of senior year of high school. Yeah. So I drove. And we go to this house and we're in this basement. And I remember like, there's like 60 people. There's like way too many people for the size of this basement. Okay, so lots of people crammed into a small space. If a fire marshal showed up, he would not be happy, you know? So these people from another school show up who are friends with mutual friends from people from Glenbow West or whatever. And a little bit later, someone someone, um, says like, cops, like the cops, so the cops are there. So someone yells like, cops, and so, you have like 60 people trying to run out the back door of this basement, oh of single door, yeah. you know, of this basement, and I'm one of the first few, pe- first few people to get out of here. Yeah. There's a fence. That- so I hop the fence, climb over, jump down. I run about halfway across the backyard of the neighbor before I just stop and turn around. And I turn around and I see like some other people have climbed over and then there's like five or six people on the fence and it's like it's wavering oh my God. just a little bit because oh there's all these people yeah, trying to hop yeah, on the fence and there's people you know what I'm saying and, it, and I look and it wave, it's wavering and it just falls over oh my God. and this flood of teenagers starts running across <laughs> it so I'm like shit I gotta hop over this other fence so I <laughs> same fence like 8 foot fence hop that fence and uh, run like 10 or 15 feet Stop, turn around, and again the same thing. I see You're kidding teenagers me. Two on fences? it. I see teenagers on it. No, and it's like starts to waver again. Are you kidding? And me? it falls over, and so I just turn around and I run, oh and I hear, my God. I hear, Victor, Victor, and I stop and I turn around, Victor, Victor. It's Nicole. She was on, she was had straddled the fence when it fell over. Yeah. So, like, she fell with the fence. I go back, and I lift it up, and I get her out, and get her out, and we, like, hide in a bush. And this sucks. It's like, fuck, like, I'm the driver. Like, everyone, I guess, met back in my car, because this is in a time where not everyone has cell phones. Yeah. You know? This was pre-universal yeah. cell phone use. And, um, and even if you did have a cell phone, it was unlikely that you just had text messages that you could text all the time. Yep. And if you did... You yeah, text got, messages just really weren't a if thing. If you did, you probably got bitched at by your parents for racking Data. up a texting, oh my goodness. texting bill. Yeah, the texting Ten cents bill. per yeah. text or something right. like that. Um, and I remember somehow we got back all <laughs> to my car and we started driving home and uh, somehow it got mentioned that it was my birthday. And Randy's like, what, it's your birthday? I'm like, yeah. So, Congratulations, man. Here, have a beer. And so he handed me, like, a can of, like, MGD. Mm. I was like, oh, thanks, dude. Mm. And I can't remember Tasty. if I opened it or not. Yeah. Um, I know when I was 17, I still thought beer was gross. Yeah. And, it took a while um, to get over that. I just remember driving home, like, man, that was a pretty kick-ass yeah. night. That was really cool. Hey guys, we hope you enjoyed this clip of our most recent episode of Stream of Thought. Remember to catch the entire thing on iTunes. And we will be uploading future clips of our next episodes of Stream of Thought to YouTube, so make sure that you subscribe. And if you like what you see, please remember to hit the like and always comment. We love your feedback, and we'll catch you next time.